Please join me for a few minutes on a journey into a very new and exciting development in solar energy production. It is about people and communities taking the future of clean energy supply in their own hands. It is about using the sun's power directly to produce electricity and make money and save costs in the process. We call it Repower Scenic Rim using a model that operates very successfully in Europe and New South Wales. It took me three years of living in a solar powered bus to realize that we can make the necessary change. And it saved me in the process about $40,000 in caravan park fees. If they do it in Europe and Shoalhaven, we can do it here in our own scenic rim. Repower Scenic Rim is fully based on the expertise and experiences of Repower Shoalhaven. Because we use the financial, technical and legal knowledge of a successful and existing project, the risks for us are minimal. Before explaining the ins and outs of Repower Scenic Rim, it is necessary to understand the basics of solar power, especially its economics. In the picture we see the 99 kilowatt system installed by Repower Shoalhaven on the roof of the local RSL club. But we start first with a small system on a residential house. We receive our power from the grid. The electricity is mainly generated in coal-fired power stations. From there it comes into the house and is then distribu distributed via power points to our electric devices. Let's bring in the solar panels. That power is also used for distribution in the house. We have two options in case we produce more energy than we use. The first is local storage in batteries. But money-wise, this is not very wise. It is too expensive. The second option is feedback into the grid. But because we pay 25 cents per kilowatt we use and only receive 8 cents per kilowatt hour we produce, this is very bad business. Unless you like to sponsor your own power supplier. The lesson is that it is good to be driven by ideals, but economics matter as well. Only produce what you use. Clearly, this leaves us with only one option for residential houses. A small cost-effective solution. To illustrate this, I will give you the figures of my own house on Tambury Mountain. Our situation is quite standard. We are sort of grey mice. We use about 6,500 kilowatt hours per year, costing around $1,500 plus $400 for connection fees. A 2 kilowatt system of $4,000 would lead to $505 per year savings and a payoff time of 8 years. The return on investment is 12.6%. This is, by the way, a much better return than you will receive from any bank or pension fund and it is tax free. But it even gets better. A smaller 1 kilowatt system of $2,000 results in $383 of annual savings and a payoff time of 5 years. The return on investment is a whopping 19%. During the rest of its life, this solar system will save you at least another $8,000. You really are a thief of your own wallet if you don't install solar now. But what has all this to do with Repower Scenic Rim? First of all, the conclusion is solar makes money. The second one is Repower Scenic Rim will advise locals about solar systems on their own roofs. But more importantly, it will establish solar on community buildings. So the main activity of Repower Scenic Rim will be to establish solar on community buildings with local shareholders. We are basically doing nothing new because this model is widely used and scrutinized. In Germany, 50% of renewable energy projects are community owned. In the Netherlands, 50% of all school roofs will have solar powers, power panels in four years using this model. In another town in, in the Netherlands, an older people's home has 512 panels. The 160,000 euros were raised in only five weeks. And in Shoalhaven, New South Wales, two churches and an RSL club have 590 panels. 
The $170,000 for that was raised in seven weeks. I'm originally from the Netherlands and I know it always rains over there. So if it does work in Holland, it will certainly work in Australia. Now let's have a look at how this really works. The first thing is that we set up a community group. This group then identifies community buildings suitable for large solar systems, for instance, churches, clubs, schools or nursing homes. If one of those wants to get free solar panels, they become the host. In the next step, the community group establishes a business, a PTY LTD, to run the solar project. The business, at its turn, sells shares to local residents who are interested in supporting the solar panel project for the host and who are keen to make a good return on investment. The funds raised in selling the shares is used to establish the solar panel on the church, the school or the nursing home. The funds are also used to pay the community group for management and administration. The final picture shows how the shareholders will be refunded. The host pays the community group for the solar power till the system has paid of itself. The community group pays the business, which pays dividends to the shareholders. Also the original investment will be refunded in this way. So what are the final outcomes? After 10 years the investors get the shares reimbursed on top of the dividends they have already received. The business will be discontinued and the church, club, school or nursing home receive permanent ownership of the solar farm for free. Okay, let me take you to a practical example of Shoalhaven Heads Bowling Club. It's a 99 kilowatt system. For $126,000 the shares were sold out in 5 weeks. 80% are mom and dad investors. 6.5% per annum is the return and dividend payments and it's an, in addition cheap power for the local businesses. The great thing for us here in the Scenic Grim is that we don't have to invent anything. Repower Shoalhaven will share with us all their knowledge and documents. Okay, let me end with some quotes from Chris Cooper who is the um, initiator in Shoalhaven. People want clean energy and secure investments. Community solar gets us over the hurdle of lack of capital. Solar energy is a win-win, a smart local response to a global problem and with community solar power we return the power to the people. I hope you are now just as excited as I am about this concept. Let's make it work. Let's change the concept into projects. Let's return the power to the people and let the scenic rim become a region ready for a sustainable future.